We believe that children are agents of positive change in our world. It is not surprising that New York City has exceptional theater and art, but it might surprise people that the press and the critics have taken a particular interest in a new children's theater operating out of the New York City Baha'i Center. Mayor Mansouri and Roya Movafeg started this individual initiative by weaving values and virtues training into their theater direction. We wanted children who usually wouldn't have the opportunity um, to be exposed to art. Most of our children are inner city children who cannot afford any kind of art related programs. There are so many questions that need answers, like how do we get so many people of different races and nationalities to accept each other? There are 45 children, 46 children, who completely internalize these principles with their parents as being very much aligned with us. And I think that's where you have to start, uh, really, to make a difference. If we believe in racial harmony, we have to start by internalizing, not just with quotes, but just by the act of getting together. America's a prime example because we've got races and nationalities of almost every kind. The Children's Theater Company centers its performances around social issues of justice. The children are not performing fairy tales to entertain other children. Instead, they present important concepts to their peers and to adults. You have to repent in this generation, not merely for the destructive words and actions of the bad people, but for the appalling talent of the good people. The Children's Theater Company integrates a variety of performance styles, including song, dance, art, and dramatic performances. By myself, all I can do is flutter. I am one way, I need the other for the dove of peace to fly. It's the journey that's more important than the destination. If we work together, if we have fun, then this is just icing on the cake. to give a warm round of applause to my dear friend, Shohar Ardashlu. Thank you. Thank you, hello, and good evening, uh, ladies and gentlemen. What's I am that? thrilled and honored. What's that? That's what they call a rocking chair. How the world seems to me. Oh, 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 oh. Mama, what's that thing?
I introduce to you Children's Theatre. with the followers of all religions, associate with all peoples and kindred of the earth with joy and radiance, which will promote unity and accord, and which, in turn, is conducive to the maintenance of order in the world and the regeneration of nations. Freedom is not worth having if it does not include the freedom to make mistakes. Mahatma Gandhi. A bruised reed he will not break. A smoldering wick he will not snuff out. And in faithfulness he will bring forth justice. The Bible. As you slide down the banister of life, may never the splinters be pointing the wrong way. <laughs> By Ralph Cramden, The Honeymooners. <laughs> Dear God, my name is Chayton. Chayton. You know, God, some people say that there is nothing that can be done about all these things. Some people say that we are violent creatures by nature. Is that true? Even me? If it is, then why did you give us the power to envision something better? Why did you give us the power to believe that we are more than just animals? You know, God, this may sound funny. Sometimes, sometimes, I think that animals treat their kind better than we humans treat each other. But there is something, something in my heart and soul that recognizes that we are not born bad. We are born noble, to do noble things. The use of folk arts, and this art is native to Southern Africa. And there were many, many people there who worked in mines, in coal mines, diamond mines. And working in those mines, they were not allowed to speak. And so they had to find another way of communicating. 